What is my YouTubers? I mean, your best pal, Dr. Dude, from the YouTube channel, Dr. Dude. Today's video, I mean, I thought you, that I haven't made a video for the last one or two months because I've been busy as working at my place. I'm like, I'm at work most of the time for you guys to do, do a YouTube video. But, anyway, for making that up, I decided to make a YouTube video. Uh, this video, I want to talk about Attack on Titan. Yeah, I know. Why you want to talk about Attack on Titan? We're going to talk about the end of Attack on Titan. Alright, the manga, the manga of this. Alright, so, before we get started, I'm going to tell y'all that I've been when we out of this place, when we out of the apartment, going back to my parents' house, you know, John, John, and stuff. Next week, so it's like the meet this is room, all right. But it's good fun and stuff. And also here, okay, let's get this started. Attack on Titan, the show and the manga that been around for so long. I was a big fan. One, I was a big fan of Attack on Titan when the show came out. Got me excited and stuff. And I had to wait for another season after season after season waiting. I read the manga too, read the manga ahead before the anime, another anime came out, alright? Kinda spoiled my fun to watch the, the anime. I know you get what I mean and stuff, but... Let's talk about the Attack on Titan, the ending, what I think about it. I was disappointed on Attack on Titan. They did the exact bad ending, just, I mean like, bad season finale. Final season of Attack on Titan. They did the same thing just like the final season of Game of Thrones. I was disappointed with the finale season the final season of the manga of Attack on Titan chapters. It made me got me tied too much in the manga in the anime. I know for all y'all so I saw the newest Attack on Titan episode, but don't get your hopes up. Alright, you know for the fact that this ending for the anime will be the same ending just like the manga. Alright, just let you guys tell you the fact. Although there will be spoiler about the ending of uh, Attack on Titan. Uh, chapter 135. Attack on, uh, the Attack on Titan final episode. I hate the ending for it. I was mad for the fact that Aaron, Aaron Yeager, who became the bad guy who tried to kill almost all the humanity to save Elia. There is a reason why he did it. So, make it because he wants to make his friends heroes of killing him. I'm like, that's why. You know, though he knew what about to happen. That power of a, the finally tiny power who can see time, who go back in time and tell anyone who do this stuff. I'm like, it. What kind of a creature inside of Aaron? What is it like? I want to won't know about that Titan creature with a spinal centipede thing. Where is it? Like, like godly creature that I've been around well, for so long and stuff. You also get me thinking about that a little bit. All right, but anyway, the end. Mikasa, Armin, Aaron, I mean, all his friends like Connie, uh, John, Gabby. Those who did not get it, all of the friends except for Mikasa um, and, and Levi didn't turn to Titan. And my other did. I'm like, the point with Aaron turning his friends to Titan except for Mikasa and Levi. Anyway, at Armin, who is inside of Eric Conti, Ar Eric tells Armin that he finally freed. He finally freed Elvio. I'm like, what do you mean free? You how you free them? By killing the pop the whole, almost the eighty percent of the Earth population of humanity. In, I'm like, and he like the only way to help out people to be free. It also makes you guys look cute, look like you of a baby. I want y'all to have a happy life. All right, we're out. I'm, I'm like, so that's why he became one to destroy humanity to make his friends look cute and make Eldia look like. Good guys, stupid. Now the way he went, Levi, when Eric 
told Armin that he loved Mikasa. I'm like, I knew it. Dude, you didn't want, you said these bad things to Mikasa, and then you told the, the Armin that you actually love her? That doesn't make great sense to them both at all. I'm a disappointed with him. After that, they were continuing talking that how much he wanted to be free and stuff. You know, the Ymir, Ymir still loves King Fritz after all that thing he did. I was disappointed that he died for, the, for saving his, her love. Jesus Christ, man. That is crazy talk. I'm disappointed with this ending more. After that, because I managed to kill our Aaron, bite his head off, but take it. And may also after that, everybody who turned to Titan turned to human. Everybody was celebrating, but those that are left, like 20% of humanity that are left, still are mad with his people, Carmen and the others, and their people for what they did. But however, Armin told them that they managed to save them and stuff. Out of that, Mikita took Aaron's head and left. Without knowing where, he, where they went. And also, out of that, there were the end, the, the, the ending for it. Out of that, there are two endings. I mean, one in the ending where three, it took place three years later. All humanity recovering from the damage that happened to them and also preparing to go to war with Elvia. Like a long war. And after that, we see Armin and the other on the ship together make try to make Eldia and the other countries be at peace and stuff. They hope that one day they will go to peace. And after that, we can start to at the tree where he placed Eren's head in the ground and stuff. And I'm like, who she with? Where, where, yeah. Yeah. But however, when the when I did the other end of it, same thing and stuff, but however, thank you guys for that. The old Mikatan did put Aaron's head in the tree and bury him. But however, after she died of old, old age, war broke it out. Whole tie of LD. Island bombarded by user uh, realistic weaponry like jets and stuff. Whole thing gone the trend like a file. And then after that we saw a little kid who discovered a tree. Big huge tree. It looked like the same tree from the previous chapter where Ymir uh, fell into the hole where of a tree and discovered the bounce kind of. I suggest I am like so we saw a new cycle again. The child found a finally titan selling pee and become the founding titan. It turned out it did not er Mikasa didn't really kill the founding titan sent pee. It's bad like hidden, like like detached itself from it so it could survive. Then I'm like, here's a theory. What if Yumiya was the first to found the founding titan? More like somebody else did before her, like long, long time ago. That's a theory. Why not? That's a theory I want thinking about. Where did it happen before? Like long, long time ago. Who really did down the centipede Titan? Really? That's the problem. The ending sucked. The creator of the Attack on Titan had rushed the whole entire ending. Just like the directors of the final season of Game of Thrones. I hope you are happy for what you did, man, alright? No, you know, I don't know if the anime will do the same thing, but I believe it does. But I don't want y'all to get your hopes up on the final season of Attack on Titan, alright? And also the ending, I hate people think that the ending will be, of uh, the anime will be the Y'all never read the manga, read, read it, man, alright? Okay, so, um, that's about it, about the ending of it. Game of Thrones, I mean, Tag of Time is doing the same stupid thing. I'm sorry, y'all, but I suggest you guys don't watch the final 
season of Attack on Titan. It's going to come out next year. Another year. They really do waste our time waiting for the anime. Another anime season to come out. Alright. So, this is my video about why Attack on Titan ending stuff. Alright. So, please subscribe to this channel and click the notification below. Click comment down below. And I'll see you guys next time.